Court. And the trailblazing journalist Helen Thomas has died at the age of 92. Widely known as the dean of the White House Press Corps, Helen Thomas became the first woman assigned to the White House full-time by a news service when she began to cover the Kennedy administration. She went on to cover every president since until controversial comments on the Israel-Palestine conflict forced her to retire in 2010. Throughout the two-term Bush administration, Helen Thomas asked some of the most critical questions in the White House press newsroom. She challenged the administration on issues including the Iraq war and its massive civilian toll, the threat of an attack on Iran, the refusal to sign a cluster bomb treaty, the ongoing killings of Afghanistan civilians and its critical support for Israel's attacks on Gaza and Lebanon. In July 2007, President George W. Bush reverted to a presidential press conference tradition he'd long ignored, giving Thomas the first question. Now I'll be glad to answer a few questions, starting with Ms. Thomas. Mr. President, you started this war, the war of your choosing. You can end it alone today. At this point, bring in peacekeepers, UN peacekeepers. Two million Iraqis have fled this country as refugees. Two million more are displaced. Thousands and thousands are dead. Don't you, don't, don't you understand? We brought the Al Qaeda into Iraq. Uh, actually, um, I was hoping to solve the Iraqi issue diplomatically. That's why I went to the United Nations and worked with um, the United Nations Security Council, which unanimously um, passed a resolution that said, disclose, disarm, or face serious consequences. That was the message, a clear message, to Saddam Hussein. He chose the course. It, it was his decision. That's the late Helen Thomas questioning President George W. Bush in July of 2007. Earlier that year, I interviewed Helen Thomas at the Media Reform Conference in Memphis. I asked her for her take on the consolidation of media control by a small number of mega corporations. I'm telling them, forget about all those profits and help the country. That the media should be a public service. You cannot have a democracy without an informed people. And that should be their role. They can make their money everywhere else. That was Helen Thomas speaking on Democracy Now! in 2007. She died on Saturday at the age of 92.